The roadworks are having an influence on the way we can measure whether the Gao train is alleviating some of the traffic. Maybe you can just tell us what that's about. Yeah. Look, at, at, at the moment we're carrying about 32,000 uh, passengers a, a day and we're getting a, a minimum of people coming over from existing public transport. So these are mm -hmm. in all probability um, motorists. So they, they're off the roads, that, that ha they have to be off the roads. Whether they're part of a lift club and they're now not going in the lift club, so it's, it's very difficult. Another thing is that you can't really test what is happening on the freeways uh, because of the, the construction work. They, they're doing quite major construction work still. They've closed one lane um, of Benchcombe all the way from Brockfontein up to Buclou. Uh Then w once that's finished, mm -hmm. uh, we still can't really say because we, we have the the Rosebank Park link um, that hasn't been completed and, and we are of the opinion that people that that want to go from Pretoria Station, Hatfield Station, Centurion Station to Park, um, they wouldn't, very few of them would have changed their habits, you know, to say let's go up to Rosebank then try and get a bus into the CBD, go from the CBD up to my destination. So we'll see in the end of December when when, the, when that link is open. Mm -hmm. And then finally, when, when the toll tariffs actually kick in uh, in February next year, uh, we will then see. So there's really a few steps that have to be taken to see what our final ridership is going to be and really to see whether we are impacting on the traffic or how big our impact is. I think the biggest and most recent news is obviously the opening of the Hatfield route. Yeah. Um, tell us a bit about that. Are you finding it quite successful? Yes, again, <coughs> you know, this is really changing people's daily habits. This mm -hmm. is talking to commuters that have got a certain pattern, a certain travel pattern, and saying to them, leave your travel pattern, change it, mm -hmm. and, and, and go to the train. So it's been a major jump, and that's the, the unknown. We've never done that on this scale before in, in our country, where we've targeted the motorist and said, yes, I'll turn as a public transport thing. Mm -hmm. so, so it's been exciting. Uh, the feedback's been very great. The people love it. Um, we have really the exception where people are complaining. They are saying it's magic, they love it. Uh, and I think what, what is quite interesting is the way that you can relax on the train. I mean, if you, I've been commuting now since 95 from Pretoria to Joburg, so I've been on the, on the system now for 16 years. And it becomes, you see a, a very serious accident about once a week now. Mm -hmm. So it, it's quite stressful, you can't relax yeah, and the wheel because you see people really having major accidents, being cut out of the cars and that. So, so as soon as you get on the train, you can relax, you can read the newspaper, you can do some work. So, uh, and I think that's something that, that the middle class hasn't been used to. You know, you mm. get into your car and you battle to get to work. You battle to get in time uh, because of the congestion. You can't predict how long the, the trip will be. So that's working quite well. So we, we're very happy with that. What is next for the Gau train? So that's most likely the Rosebank link. Yeah, I don't know for sure. How is construction going on that? Well, remember, we, we have more water in the tunnel than what we, that, that what we wanted okay. or specified. So uh, they have actually started working on the remedial work uh, about a week ago. We're doing an 80 meter test section. We were drilling and grouting and then measuring the water flow and if we have to go back and do a reiteration. So we're going to see how many iterations we need to, to get the water uh, back to. So it, it, it's a, firstly, it's a, um, before we get the results back of this test section, we can't say how long it's going to be because okay. if you have to do one iteration versus three or four or five, mm -hmm. it'll obviously take longer. But we are still confident that we can do it by the end of the year. Okay. Um, hopefully open it up for the Christmas period, but if not um, early next year.